Why do pro gamers use 400 dpi? Before I start, this video is not for controller players, so if you're on controller, I'm kinda sorry. You probably see Fortnite pros like Tifu or Symphony use 400 dpi, or ask yourself why almost every Valorant or CSGO pro uses 400. First, let me show you what 400 dpi is. dpi is basically your mouse sensitivity, and 400 is definitely on the lower side of that. In fact, if you see a pro with a huge mouse pad, they most likely use 400 dpi. Another sign someone is using 400 dpi is when they use your whole arm to aim which I will get into later it's basically how many dots per inch you can move on your mouse which affects the speed and sensitivity of it first let me show you the benefits of 400 dpi and why it's better than 800 and 1600 pros love this sensitivity because they can be more accurate with their aim lower sensitivities are more accurate because you can move your mouse into a specific direction before firing which is also called micro adjustments this lets you aim at a specific angle for example if you want to adjust to someone's head your aim will be more fluent than if you have 1600 dpi where you will have a harder time aiming at a specific point pros usually use their whole arm to make big movements like when you're trying to go into a whole another direction and they use their wrist and fingers to aim at something for example think of a big medium and small paintbrush the big one is for your arm the middle one for your hand and the small one for your fingers with higher dpi you're not using your arm to aim so you're missing out on a whole new style of aiming if you're using a higher dpi it's way easier to look in a different direction but it's way harder to aim at a specific spot without your crosshair moving a little bit off plus 400 dpi pros get so used to it that they don't even feel like it's hard to move their whole mouse through their whole mouse pad Another reason pros use 400 dpi is because your tracking and flicking aim also improves. Having a higher dpi won't be as stable, so if you tilt your mouse like a centimeter, it's going to ruin your aim. With a low dpi, you can track and flick smoother and with ease. You don't have to put as much pressure on your wrist when you can just move your whole arm a certain direction. Flicking is also easier because it's much more accurate. Since an enemy is exposed at a farther direction, having your gun aim at a precise spot is key. And 400 dpi lets you do that. Aiming isn't the only thing that low dpi is good for. Pros use 400 dpi for their long term health too. Pros game day after day for years and hours and hours on end. And if you use wrist aiming, you can really develop some issues you don't want. Problems like carpal tunnel syndrome can cause tingling and numbness in your wrist and hand. If you want to play competitively for years, arm aiming is the way to go. So why do pros use 400 dpi in a high sense and not a high dpi in low sense? In some games like CSGO, there is something called frame skipping. Frame skipping is when your crosshair aims at a frame but not exactly at a target. This can seem annoying, it won't affect your game as much. But for pros, frame skipping is really hard to get over with so they just switch to 400 for the best thing possible. This isn't the main reason, but it's still something the pros hate. Like everything, there are some exceptions to this. A small percentage of top pros still use a medium to high sensitivity because they can move faster. So, in conclusion, does this all mean that you should switch to 400 dpi? Not really. Everyone always says that sensitivity is a personal preference. They're not wrong, but you still have to think about how high is too much and how low is too low. I would say around 400 to 1600 is okay for the average person. Also, keep in mind DPI is nothing without in-game sensitivity, so try to adjust to a more lower sensitivity too. I will say that if you work your way down to 400 DPI, it will be the most beneficial, but if you're comfortable with your sensitivity right now, you're not so bad. In fact, many pros use 800 dpi since they're better with that fast paced flicking play style. This isn't for everyone though, so try to choose a dpi and stick with it. Because if you change it too much, it's gonna hurt more than help because you gotta readjust every time. Thanks for watching and let's have a discussion about this in comments below.